All right, so you might recognize this from a few videos ago. It had an outdoor unit fault. I'm pretty sure it was the board, but the customer just wants to replace the whole unit. So I'm here now to decommission it, reclaim the gas, disconnect everything, and work out a plan. And then tomorrow, me and a friend of mine are coming in, and we're going to do the changeover. Um, Tom's overseas at the moment, so I've got another mate helping us out. He's only available on Saturdays, so coming to give us a hand. So yeah, I'm just here to sort of get this thing um, decommissioned and sort of ready for us to come in tomorrow and work out a plan. So I'm going to obviously I'm going to change the brackets. I'm going to put some galvanised ones on. Obviously, put an isolator on the wall. Make some few improvements but it's just going to go there on brackets again anyway I'll get this thing reclaimed and we'll go from there right it's done so I've disconnected the electrical that is broken so obviously and plus it's got a join in it, pretty dicey, so I'm going to sort all that out. Um, I'll probably just cut it there, put some hard drawn in there, or like rigid conduit and put an isolator down there or something. And disconnected the pipe. Honestly, Andre the Giant himself must have done that up. <laughs> Honestly, can't loosen that, that's alright. I'll just cut it, um, put it all back together get it on the trolley, take it back to the van. I'll drop this thing off at the scrapyard on the way home. Yeah, I'll measure up the new stuff, the new one, and start putting some brackets on. All right, so the original indoor has been removed. It was just hung by a perforated strap. So I've taken it out we got um, uni strut and booker rod, which is way better. Sorry, there's not much room in here. Way better.
But as you turned, I was like, I knocked the thing and I was really just put my ass over to hospital or something like that and I had to do a duck bit with the boys on a week and then I yeah. promised to walk with them. Right, so this thing's vacuuming. Just sorting out the isolator now. Um, Scott's inside putting the return air vent in, so we're nearly done. So, yeah, finish this and we'll give it a test run. Right, that's it, it's done. Basically, Power comes out, up in rigid conduits into here, this is all sealed. Um, that goes straight up into the back. That's interconnect, that's power. That's all sealed at the back. And that one is just an aerial cable, it's nothing to do with me. So basically the aircon just comes straight down the eave in this trunking straight into the back, straight up, and yeah, got an isolator now. Because of this, I just went Coro into that instead of going over it. Anyway, on brackets, now it's got gal brackets, galvanised and galvanised fixings. Yeah.